Okay, we're going to start by making one magic circle. One chain. And then we are going to back to the magic circle and make six single crochets. I have two, three, four, five, and six. Close the magic circle. Okay, slip a stitch, chain one. For the number two, we're going to make six increases. At the end, we should have 12 single crochets. Continue making four more increases. Slip stitch to join. For the number three, we are going to make one, two, three, and four. The chain four uh, counts as one double crochet and one um, chain. In the next stitch, make one double crochet, one chain, one double crochet in the next stitch, one chain, and one double crochet in the next stitch. For the number three, you're going to be making one double crochet, one chain, one double crochet. I will finish with one chain, and we're going to slip uh, on the third chain, one, two, and three. Okay, we have one, two, and three rounds. For the number four, chain one, go back to the same space and make one single crochet. Increase in the next stitch, in the next uh, chain one space, one single crochet on top of the double crochet. Increase in the chain one space. Single crochet on top of the double. Increase in the chain one. Just continue repeating this all the way around. A slip stitch to join. And for the number five, one, two, three, and four chains. Now we're going to skip one stitch in between. So skip this stitch in the next, make one double crochet. One chain, skip one stitch in the next, double crochet. One chain, skip one in the next, double crochet. One chain, skip one stitch and one double crochet. Just continue repeating this all the way around. Chain one, and we are going to slip a stitch on top of the third chain here. Now we're going to start the number six, chain one, single crochet in the first uh, on top of the chain two, and one increase in the chain one space. One single crochet, one increase. one single crochet and increase keep repeating this all the way around a slip stitch to join for the number seven one two three and four chains we're going to skip one stitching in the next double crochet chain one skip one stitch go to the next double crochet one ch one chain, skip one stitch, one double crochet, one chain, skip one, and double crochet. You're going to be working as in this round here, and just keep repeating all the way to the end. Okay, at the end of the number seven, we're going to have two stitches here, so just skip these two stitches, and a slip stitch on top of the chain three here, And for the number eight, we are going to make a total of six single crochets and then one increase. One, two, three, four, five, six. Increase in the next stitch. Then one, two, three, four, five, six, and then one increase. 
you are going to continue repeating this making six uh, single crochets and then one increase okay after the last increase i end up making only three single crochets now we're going to slip stitch to join And for the number nine, one, two, three, and four, we are going to skip one stitch in the next one double crochet. One chain, skip one, and one double crochet, one chain. We're going to skip one in the next one double crochet. Let's continue repeating one double crochet, chain one, skipping one, and then one double crochet. Okay, I have two stitches left here so I will make my chain and I will skip the two stitches and slip stitch on top of the third chain here for the next round is going to be the number 10 and we're going to be making one single crochet in each stitch around I am done with the round number 10 and now for the number 11 all the way to number 15 we are going to be repeating the number 9 and the number 10 so the next one is going to be four chains and then we are going to skip one stitch and double crochet in the next one chain skip one double crochet in the next and for the next uh, round you're going to be making one single crochet in each stitch so just keep repeating the number nine in nine and ten until you have 15. I have 15 rounds in total and now for the number 16 we are going to add wire. This is 22 gauge. And we are going to start by making one chain. And make six single crochets one two three four five and six and then we're going to make one decrease single crochet two together or one decrease so make one, two, three, four, five, and six. Then make one decrease. Insert the hook, pull up a loop, go to the next space here, pull up a loop. You have three loops on the hook, turn over and go to the, old, the loops on your hook. This is the sequence for the number 16, making six single crochets and then one decrease. Before we finish, we are going to cut the wire. And we are going to uh, go around or twist the wire here a little bit. Just like that. Uh, for the last round, we are going to change color. We are going to finish the slip stitch with the white color. And for the last round, it's going to be the number 17. We are going to be making one single crochet in each stitch around. Okay, 
Okay, and we are done here, just a slip a stitch, one chain, and we can cut the yarn. Next is going to be the flowers. I will use white color for that. We start by making one magic circle, chain one. Into the magic circle, we are going to make a total of six single crochets. I have three, four, five, and six close the magic circle and make sure you leave a little bit of space here for the stem and we're going to slip a stitch on top of the first single crochet now for the number two we're going to make six increases and we're going to be hiding this tail along the way at the end of the number two we should have 12 single crochets A slip a stitch to join and for the number three start by making one chain go back to the same space and make one single crochet then one increase in the next stitch the sequence is going to be one single crochet and then one increase and at the end we should have 18 single crochets finish with one slip a stitch and for the number four all the way to number seven we are going to be making one single crochet in each stitch around no more increases just make one single in each stitch all the way to the round number seven i am done here i have seven rounds and now for the number eight we are going to start with one chain go back to the same space and make one single crochet and in the next two stitches, we are going to make one decrease taking the front loops of the stitches. One single crochet and then one decrease. One single crochet and one decrease. Just keep repeating this all the way around. At the end, we should have 12 single crochets. For the number nine, one chain, go back to the same space and make one single crochet, half double crochet, and one double crochet. Go to the next stitch and make one double crochet, half double crochet, in one single crochet we have the first pattern next single crochet half double crochet double crochet in the next stitch one double crochet one half double crochet and then one single crochet this is how we're going to be working the round number nine and we are going to finish with one slip stitch here on top of the first single crochet one chain and ready i will um need six of these flowers for the leaves we are going to start by making 20 chains one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen and twenty we are going to add the wire between the hook and the yarn and beginning in the second chain from the hook we are going to make single crochet single crochet in the next and single crochet in the next then we are going to make half double crochet half double crochet in the next and then we are going to make a total of eight double crochets one two continue making six more after the eight double crochets we're going to make 
two half double crochets one two and then three single crochets one two and three in the last we're going to make three single crochets one two and three now we can fold the wire and cut it okay working in the opposite side we're going to be hiding this tail along the way we want to make three single crochets one two and three then two half double crochets and then eight double crochets Then two half double crochets. And then we're going to make three single crochets. One, two, and three. slip a stitch on top of the first single crochet and we're going to be making one more round making one single crochet in each stitch here on the top we're going to make one and two single crochet and then we are going to continue in the opposite side making one single crochet all the way to the end we're going to pass these wires here and then we are going to wrap this little piece With yellow color, we are going around three fingers one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And we are going to add the wire like this then we are going to cut this part We are going to wrap the stem We are going to pass the stem here in the magic circle. Just like this. And let it dry. 
Then we're going to wrap this part here. We are going to make a knot here, and from here we are going to finish this part first. We can add a little bit of the hot glue, Oops. then we can start wrapping this part here. With white color, we can attach it on any of these uh, double crochets here. Make one single crochet. Then we are going to chain 15. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. We are going to make one slip stitch on top of the single crochet. One chain. In we can cut the yarn. Now we just need to hide these two ends inside. And now we can add it to our piece here. 